Hello, I'm Mixed Miles and Mile Man, and welcome to my channel. And today's video will also be my little tiny Riley boy. Say hi, Riley boy. Call me. Why is Santa Claus? <laughs> I call you Riley Santa Claus. I must be Mick, Mick Turkey then, am I? Yeah. Mick Turkey. Um, in today's video, it's a quick little uh, pre-Christmas video, if you like. Um, I've had a couple of gifts um, sent to me and given to me by some friends and bits and pieces. And um, because the kitchen is now done, I can come back down the shed. I have not been down the shed for about three weeks in total because the weather's been absolutely shocking down here in the UK. Sorry. And I mean, oh, it's been so bad, so wet in the garden. The lawn is still um, not flooded, but just so wet. I just can't walk. I don't want to walk on it. So, so that's that. Um, <coughs> so, <coughs> in today's video, I'm going to be. I've got some reviews. I've got a rotary tool. Uh, it's come from China called a dis a, a, a dis tech um, rotary tool, a bit like a Dremel. Uh, someone sent me one and they want me to, to do a review on that. So that'll be coming very, very soon. And also somebody else has sent me this Tezlong, which again will be a Chinese product. And this is a, um, two seconds, right? hang on, two seconds, buddy. I need to get it open first before you start tearing at it. This is an endoscope. Um, so it's got, it's got the screen it's and it's got all the camera. destructions and it's got the lead as well. So for checking down inside, inside bore holes and what have you, um, got its own screen, its own camera, and some and some adapters there with hooks and mirrors on. Um, but I've already got one. I've got quite a nice one that I just plug straight into my phone. But I said what I would do is I will um, I'll do a review on this one, and then I'll give it away to somebody else as well. So if you are interested in in perhaps getting your hands on a endoscope from uh, from Teslong, uh, it's even got a torch on the end of there, which is quite handy to have, I suppose. Um, if you're interested in, in getting your hands on this uh, Teslong um, endoscope, then keep watching in, in videos coming up, because I should be doing uh, a review on it very, very soon, and then giving it away uh, to one of my lucky subscribers um, in, in the next coming video. So keep an eye on that. I just want to make sure I put it in the box right, otherwise we'll have a problem, right? It goes around that way there, I think, Riley boy. Around that way like that. So yeah, there's a Teslong uh, endoscope oh. video coming soon, and uh, if, you want, if you want to get your hands on it for nothing, I'll send it to you, free of charge, once I've done the review, so that's good. Um, someone sent me off my Amazon wish list. Yes, I have an Amazon wish list. This is getting very hot on my turkey head, um, Riley boy. I'm going to put a, uh, I'll put a Santa hat on, shall I, instead? Ho, ho, ho. That's, yeah, ho, 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 that's a bit better. Let's put a Santa hat on, a bit, a bit more forgiving. Right. Um, someone sent me off my Amazon wish list um, some, uh, I think it's 10, 10 uh, pencils. Just, just for uh, not, not drumsticks, no. Yeah. Just, just for drawing, yeah. And they come with their own, their own uh, uh, pencil yeah. sharpener as well, which is cool. Um, but I don't know who that was. There was no name of that. But if, what, if you just send me ten uh, extra long marking pencils, then uh, please put a comment in the comment section down below, because I would like to say thank you very much to you. So please thank make you. sure you do that. Um, someone also bought me, which is very nice, some black donkey. Coffee I said um, off my Amazon wish list. Um, I've got my own coffee machine down at the bottom of the old workshop there, I and um, I ran out. And this is decaffeinated, so I only drink decaffeinated coffee now because normal coffee sends me nuts. So um, thank you very much to whoever sent me that as well. I don't know who it was, no message about one either. So thank you very much for my coffee. And then this one uh -huh. here, this has come from, I think his name is the, Hill, the Hillbilly, Hillbilly something or other. He's, a, he's one of my subscribers. And uh, he quite often, every sort of four or five months, he sends me um, blue roll. But he normally sends me sends me one pack. But in fact, he sent me two. So thank you very much, Hillbilly. Um, much you. appreciate, mate. As always, they're on my Amazon wish list, and that will keep me going for quite a while now. So super happy with that. Um, my friend Dougie over at um, oh. um, yes, mate. Hey, Dougie. <laughs> Dougie. He's got his own channel. Now, he has recently just changed his name on his channel. So let me go and let me grab my phone quick. Wasn't prepared for that. Let me grab my phone. I uh, just want to check it, check out his, uh, his channel name. Just want to give him a shout out, because he gave me a load of stuff. Uh, let me find his channel. I want to get it right. I, I know he was on about changing his channel name. He hasn't, he's been on YouTube a long old time, but uh, he hasn't got, he hasn't got a, a great deal of, of um, subscribers. Let me just check his channel name for you. Right, so I just found it. Took a bit, took a bit of fun. He only put a video out three days ago. Um, in fact, in fact, it was probably uh, day after that because he'd done two videos. So his name is at um, Doug at Dizzy Lizzie's. Oh. 
Go and check Doug out. Um, he's got a picture of, I think it's his mum uh, on the front of it. So Doug at Dizzy Lizzy's, all one word. Go and check out Doug and uh, put a comment in his Thanks comment Doug. section to say, um, Mix Mo is a merman and Riley Boy have sent you over to go and see him. He's got a wealth of knowledge, um, but he is just starting to do videos up again, yeah. Call me Riley Pearson Santa Claus. Riley Pearson Santa Claus. Slide down. Oh, yeah, no problem. So Doug has sent me over. I went to see Doug because Doug said to me, um, he can get SEA 30 oil and uh, carburetor clean quite cheap. He, buy, he buys it in bulk. And Doug has got um, a lawnmower repair shop uh, business and he gets it really cheap, cheap, cheap. So um, he said, if everyone is it, Mick, just give me a shout. So Doug gave me a nice little um, plastic funnel uh, with a filter in it as well. So cheers for that, Doug. He gave me a couple of rags. He also gave me a lump of blue roll as well. So I've got loads of blue roll now. And I also bought off of him uh, some carburetor spray. This worked out. I've got four tins of carburetor spray, three quid a tin. So that was cheap. So cheers for that, Doug. And then he also gave me a microwavable dish um, for putting in under, car under Honda carburetors and whatever. So that, that, that works really, really well. Oh, Two seconds. Yeah, careful, buddy boy. You're, not, don't, you know, you're okay. Sorry. And then on top of that, he gave me, uh, I think that was it. I don't think there's any more in there. He gave me, yeah, he gave me uh, some um, carburetor bowl nut copper washers to go on the bottom of the bowl nut so they can press nice and I've got, I've got some slightly thinner ones of those as well and then on top of that he gave me these because someone um i was doing a repair for somebody a little while ago and they ran out of oil and he's given me some uh check oil daily um stickers uh to put on on lawn mowers um once you service and we put a check all check all daily stickers there as well so that's a really good idea so yeah happy with those i'll put them back in the bag mate because you because they're going missing if you get all of them so thank you very much, Dougie boy. Much appreciated. Hey, Dougie. Hey, Dougie. Um, let's put them back into there. Lovely job. Put them into there and put the rags back and the funnel back. And then the last one to come in, uh, this came in just yesterday. Joe for me. Uh, no, for, these are all for Danny at the moment, but we'll, go, we'll, we'll find a way of getting you a present in a minute. Okay, and the last little gift we've got to come in is from a very good friend of mine called Mr. Lawnmower Jones. He sent us a parcel. And we've got a nice looking um, vintage lawnmower club. The old lawnmower club baseball cap there is there. That's quite nice. We'll try it on, Riley. Take it half. That's it. Try this one off, see if that fits. Bit big for your head. Let's just put it down a couple of sizes. What do you say to Mr. Lawnmower Jones? What do you say? Figure it anyway. Thank you, anyways. Fantastic. Riley Boy is struggling a little bit. He's off school at the moment. Don't pick your lip, buddy. He's off school at the moment. He's struggling. Uh, also got a card here. Uh, it's from the same guy from Lawnmower Jones. He's got a lawnmower in the snow. I don't remember him. You don't remember him? Well, I'll take you to see him one day. There's a lawnmower hidden in the snow. And this says uh, to Mick and the mowers family, um, happy mower hunting for 2024 from Richard and Mr. Lawnmower Jones. So thank you very much indeed. Go and check out Mr. Lawnmower Jones on YouTube and send and put a comment in the section as well to say that Mixed Mows and Mower Man have sent you. And he sent us one more present here as well, which is not funny, Rich, uh, Mr. L Mr. Jones. Um, he sent me a, uh, a torch spark plug. Torch spark plug. Now we all know that Mr. Mowers um, only does one thing with um, torch spark plugs. They're only good for one thing, aren't they? He, in fact, let's, let's make sure he hasn't put a B2LM in there. Let's have a look. Um, let's have a look. It's a torch. GL2C, and these are only good for one thing. I do In fact, Riley wants to do it. Torch spark plugs are only good for one thing, and that is, do it. Smashing windows, there you go. Um, we, don't, we don't use torch spark plugs in, in, in this um, workshop. Never have, never will. Um, don't like them. So that's good. The only one other present I've got here, which I bought myself just the other day, because it's getting really muggy, really muggy and stuff. So no problem, mate. It's good. You're, you're doing okay, mate. I know, you, I know you're struggling, Riley boy. I know you're struggling. Um, I bought these myself. What was that? Oh, it's a bit, a bit, a bit of paper. I bought myself a pair of, um, these are um, dungarees. Why A pair of dungas, or they call them bib and braces over here. I've got a nice pair. I will try them later on. Um, they're uh, the work ones, ones with pockets on the outside and whatever, so bought myself a nice pair of dungarees. So that's it for the video. So all I want to say is, guys and girls, we're, pardon me, we're on the ramp up to Christmas. Christmas is just around the corner. We want to thank you for all the um, support and help that you've given me and Riley Boy. I think we've got up to now about 23, oh, before I forget, don't forget, I've got, also got a sign here, I must um, say thank you, to um, 
Mend It Man. He sent me a uh, rather nice looking Steger sign just there up on the wall. Um, thank you very much thank indeed, uh, Luke from Mend It Man. He, um, he sent me a nice little um, Steger sign. In fact, he gave it to me. I just sort of bullied him into it. Um, but we're about 23,000 subscribers now and we want to go up and up and up and up and up and up. And uh, just want to say thank you for, um, for supporting me and Riley Boy through, through the channel's growth and what have you. We seem to be doing really, really well. And we're really enjoying it, aren't we, buddy? Really enjoying it. Having a good time. So keep on coming. If you want to send me or Riley Boy a little tiny gift for Christmas, um, today is, is quite early. It's about the 8th, I think, of December. So it's all time. Check out my Amazon wish list um, down below in the comment section or in the um, description. There's a, um, an Amazon wish list there where you can, there's gifts and bits and pieces for me and Riley Boy. Feel free to drop us a, um, a couple of pounds via PayPal or via the um, Amazon wish list there. And uh, if you give us a, um, a little gift, we'll give you a shout out in the video as well. So we do it every Christmas. It just spreads a little bit of Christmas joy. I do understand cost of living crisis and whatever. So if you can't afford it, don't do it. But if you can afford it and you want to do it and show some appreciation to the channel, then uh, yeah, feel free to hit the old um, hit the old Amazon wish list there and um, and buy me and Riley Boy a bit of festive cheer. So that's good. So thank you very much to everybody, Mr. Jones, uh, my mate Dougie Boy, um, hey, Hillbilly Boy for, 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 um, for the blue roll, and um, Mr. Lorma Jones, bits and pieces. Mr. Jones, we'll come and see you. I've got a 10 blade cylinder here. 10 blade cylinder, which come with a mower, which I need, I've got a bed knife for it uh, uh, in the door somewhere. Um, that's got to be sharpened. So I'll, I'll be coming to see you just after Christmas, Mr. Jones. I've got a 14 and a 17 inch blade um, cylinder I want you to sharpen for me, please. So that's it. So if you like this video of Mixed Mother Merman, on, um, thank you very much to everybody for giving us um, bits and pieces thank for Christmas. You. Then um, hit the subscribe button and whack the old bell. Ho, ho, ding. Ho, ho, ding. That way you'll be notified next time we have another video. I'm looking forward to seeing this episode of Mixed Mother very, very soon. But to the girls, much more importantly, take it easy.